this specific training I'm going to teach you is called the FB Chatbot Marketing Campaign. And I'm going to share with you how I will be using Chatbot for, well, my marketing campaign. I mean, titles of my training is so straightforward. I mean, it's, it's, it's just as it is, you know. Whatever I'm doing, I mean, that is the name of the product title. So I don't need to crack my brain to come up with some fancy name and so on. So I'm going to share with you how I will be using Chatbot for my next campaign. I mean, I use Chatbot in the past, but this is what I will be doing again. And you will see that some of the approach, some of the tactics resemble to the same concept, the same core principle and the strategies for affiliate marketing uh, with with the Facebook chatbot. So the the way how this training is going to work is that I'm going to walk you through step by step so that you can see the entire blueprint and you can copy. The whole purpose of me doing this training, it is not to tell you about my stuff, but to tell you the, the exact campaign that I'll be doing so that you can copy it. So this is why I want to walk you through step by step with you. So let's start here. Uh, the first thing that, that you need to have if you want to, if you want to, uh, if you want to do a campaign is you gotta have an offer. So the offer that I'll be having is offering my best selling book for free with your chatbot. So the whole concept is to focus on how you can add value to the community, in this case, to your audience. I don't like to use the word prospects because they are not really prospects. They are more like your audience. So uh, you got to have an offer. And that offer is what entice someone to click on the send message, to type whatever your preferred keyword that will trigger the chatbot. So it's about offering something that is valuable. In my case, in my campaign, it will be offering my best-selling book for free. And it's very likely that I'll be offering uh, my book called The International Player, which is uh, a real best-selling book that we used to have in the offline stores. So how do we make this campaign a bit different? What kind of um, ad copy that we will use? So this is how the ad copy is going to be. It's going to be a video ad. Just like what uh, I've taught here pre earlier, it's uh, a video ad. And there will be some uh, written description, but the written description will be based on the video's content. So these are three key things that I will hit, that I will express in the ad. The first one is that I will pitch on the value of the book. So whatever offer that you have, you should be able to summarize everything in a sentence or two. So in this case, the international player, the international player is my best selling book that was previously sold in a local bookstore. Now, what is this book is about? This book is about showing how a local player can become an international authority uh, worldwide. And if you are a Malaysian, time out. Assuming that my target audience is Malaysian, assuming that I'm writing this ad to Malaysians, I will say this. So if you are Malaysian, how you could build your brand to become worldwide and have customers from US, UK, and all around the world. So that's basically uh, the pitch of the value of the book, like what this offer is about. So that's the first part. And the second part is this. Now there must be something unique than what they have seen because they have seen about uh, this book offer very frequently lately. Now, depending on when you're watching this this video training, if you're watching this live, of course, whatever I'm saying to you is happening right now. But if you watch this like five years down the road, uh, it will be different, right? So what is happening right now? What is happening is that many marketers are using the book offer. The whole concept of free book plus shipping means they have to pay for the shipping, but they get the book for free. So what I will be saying is this. Now, I know what you're thinking because you may have seen a uh, similar similar offer like this and is it is it is it okay for me to say that you're sort of sick and tired with this whole free book you know but then I have to pay for the shipping so what I'm doing here I'm creating something unique from the rest of the marketers who are you know doing the same thing like the 95% of the people who are following what everybody is doing so I'm, I'm going to be something different so that I don't get people cursing me on Facebook comments, okay? Um, then what I will say is this, is that why I'm doing this, why I am, why I am um, 
offering my book for free. So there must be a reason why you're doing this. Now, before I mention to them why I'm doing this, I will tell them, hey, you know what? Instead of, of getting free book and then you pay for shipping, here's what I'm going to do for you. In, it, instead of doing that, I'm going to give you the digital version for free with no string attached. You don't even need to subscribe to anything. Uh, all you need to do is to click on send message and let me know you want the digital version for free and I'll literally send you a link, a PDF download link so they can download the book and that's it, right? You you don't need to register for whatsoever. Now, if I do that, I've just changed the game, right? Then I'll say why I'm doing this. I'm doing this because whatever it is. Now, I haven't really figured out the ideal pitch yet, so I wouldn't be able to tell you. But what you want to learn here, the strategy here, is that you must have a reason why you're doing something so nice, why you're giving things for free. And the best reason is always a genuine reason, like exactly why you want to do that. Okay. So um, after that, what should I do? So once I do this, then I will get a lot of send messages and I will, I will be building my messenger list. So now what I need to do is I need to migrate my messenger list to my email list because email list is what, um, uh, what had, email list has been proven to be effective and profitable. Like what I've shared in my previous training, uh, if you notice all of the marketers who are selling their courses, their products, how do you think that they're selling it? Through emails, right? Even the person who say that, hey, you know, email marketing is not working anymore. You know, you should use social media. But how is he selling his whatever thing that he's selling through emails? I mean, that is something interesting that, that you want to ponder, ponder on it. Maybe that person may be using social media, but he's still using emails to sell whatever thing that he's selling. Right. So um, sometimes when it comes to market uh, learning from marketers, learning what they what they are teaching is valuable. But what could be even more valuable is learning by observing what they are doing. So this is why in my training, I teach you what I am doing, because what I am doing uh, are, are exactly happening right now. OK, so now. The next part is that I need to capture the leads from the digital book. And to do that, I'll be offering bonuses. So it's very simple. I, I don't ask them to register on a page. So this is what I'm thinking to do. I'm going to give them a PDF link directly. But I will have such um, uh, uh, an amazing offer, which is the bonuses that they will get. Uh, if they request for it and this this offer will be in the ebook itself so as they read through the ebook throughout the pages of the ebook this this offer will will keep on being shown and being shown again it's just inside a pdf itself so you'll say something like this hey um uh, if you like this book the international player would you want to have i'm just making this up right i'm not even referring to this bonus specifically would you want to have templates for your web page if you want just click here and we'll, i'll give it to you for free or if you say um would you want to have the missing chapter of this book just go ahead and click here and you can get it for free and so on right now if you are reading the international playbook like in this case like this book and you're reading this book and and it's, it's valuable content right and you got it for free and now i'm, I'm going to give you more stuff Right, and all you need to do is just click the link and request for it. What do you think that the readers will do? I think very likely that they will they will request for it, right? I mean, it's it's free, and why wouldn't they if they get real value from the content? You see where I'm coming from. So I like to uh, teach you, or I like to suggest to you, is to change your perspective of marketing, of trying to get someone to buy your stuff, to subscribe and so on. All you need to focus on, all you need to focus on is what you can do for them. If you can add real value to them, if you can take care of them, if you can help them, right? You don't need to be so, uh, 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 so driven to think of what kind of tricks or tactics that you can get them to take action. You just need to focus on how you can really help them in that sense. I know it sounds philosophical, but 
I kid you not, this is the same so-called philosophy that I use in my business. Uh, my business has been growing since then. And I attract good clients, right? I don't attract those people who want to take advantage of me. I attract people who care about me in that sense. And it's because I care for them uh, in that process, okay? So let's continue from here. Now, to... To, to grow this business further or this strategy, this is what I'm planning to do uh, in my marketing campaign. So remember earlier part that in the book itself, like in the digital book, I will have links in the book where they can request for, um, for free bonuses. And when they do that, I will capture them to become my email subscribers. So far, follow, follow me in that in that process all right good so now after they have registered what will they see they will see what we call a thank you page and in this on this thank you page what i'll do is that i will add a referral viral campaign on the thank you page and this is an additional bonus for me to grow my uh traffic and also to grow my leads without working harder now what do i mean by that so once they go to the thank you page i will tell them Hey, uh, um, I would say, hey, congratulations for getting these additional bonuses for free. Now, obviously, if you request for this bonus, you must have read a few pages of the international player. And what do you think of the book? Do you, do you enjoy? Do you like the book? Now, if you do, here's what I want to do for you, right? If you, if you feel that this book is, is valuable and if you like to share with your friends and remember, it's 100% free, it's digital right? They can get a physical physical copy, but they don't need to. It's 100% free. Now, if they request for that, and you have, say, uh, three friends who requested for, for the book, downloaded the book, I'm going to give you an additional free gift. Time out. I could say you can get my another book for 100% free. So what I'm doing is that I'm rewarding those who are sharing my free book with their friends. So let me say this again. I'm getting them to share the free book to get free rewards. So when I do that, all of the the the, the subscribers that I have will, will now start sharing and the whole thing becomes a, a cycle where the process continue again. Now in the past, I've done some viral campaign and I built thousands of additional subscribers by just integrating a viral campaign uh, in my business and this runs sort of autopilot by itself i mean if they don't share nothing happens i don't lose anything but if they share guess what the virality continue to grow from there all right so that's an extra tactic that you can deploy that you can integrate in your marketing campaign now let's talk about the messenger list so now you have built the messenger list. Now in this case, I have built the messenger list. How do I make use of the messenger list? What should I be emailing? Sorry, I, I keep on saying emailing. This is not emailing anymore. This is messaging to that because they are now inside the software, inside a platform. So the trick here, or I should say uh, the, the most important part is not to sell them stuff in your messenger, right? If you start doing that, you are now being one of the typical marketers and you are actually violating uh, the hidden rule of not respecting someone's personal space because this messenger, the messenger space, the chatbot space, well, it's, it's not, I wouldn't use the word sacred, but it's a personal space. So if you if you start selling stuff there, you're sort of violating their personal space in that sense. So how would you able to tap on this? So this is how I'm planning uh to 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 send. I mean these are uh, these are the type of messages that I will only send to my messenger list without pitching or promoting a product. The first one, whenever I have new content on my website, I will send them to my website to read blog posts. So when I do that, I would, I would send a message to my messenger list and say, uh, hey, you know, I just wrote this new article. It's called Seven Ways to Achieve 
uh, breakthrough product creation. I'm just making that up, right? And then I said, hey, if you if you like to read, click here and check it out. So as you can see, it is no selling whatsoever. It's, it's just about me giving more content. And of course, if they click there, they go to my website. My website will have other links, other offers, and so on. So what I'm doing is that I'm migrating my messenger list, taking some of them to go to my website, uh, hoping that they may like my other things on their website, and they may turn into my subscribers, or they may even turn into my customers. The next type of content that I will send out is to send them to watch my fan page videos. And I do this very often. Um, I'm not sure whether you're in my previous messenger list. I, I did the whole chatbot stuff uh, a few months ago. I've kind of stopped doing that because I'm changing to a new software. So the old one doesn't work anymore. But what I do is that I have a fan page where I have new videos coming from time to time. And whenever I have a new video, I will send to my messenger list and drive your traffic from there to the videos. So if they don't buy anything, that's okay. But why is it important? Because right now with a messenger list, I have an existing database that I can make use of anytime that I need to increase the views of my videos, the likes, the comments, and so on. Because keep in mind that these are my followers. These are people who, who love my content and so on. So logically, if I send them to my videos where <clears throat> My videos is also content driven. Guess what I get? I get a lot of likes. And when I have a lot of likes, I have a lot of views. When I run my Facebook ads, uh, you can see that the engagement is good. And because of social proof, other new viewers, the new audience may start to like because they say, hey, you know, other people are liking. So this must be pretty good. And of course, it is good content. And then they will also start to like. So I'm using the messenger list as my uh, instant traffic whenever I need to to send them to my uh, fan page videos. Next, I will send them to a Facebook group. So if you have a Facebook group, how do you view your group members? Right, you can use your messenger list to send them there. After all, they are already on Facebook. So <clears throat> getting them to join Facebook group is a no-brainer. And they just need to click join and they are now there. So now you can start building your Facebook group. And when you have larger size, you'll be able to attract more people to join your Facebook group. And the last part is that <clears throat> I will send them to attend free online workshop. Uh, it's technically, it is known as a webinar. So this is also another form of adding value because I'm not selling them anything, I'm not sending them to a sales letter, but I'll send them to an online workshop, which is again a webinar. And they can go through the webinar and at the end of the webinar, I will share my product and if they like, they can buy. If they don't want to buy, that's okay. But at the same time, how would they get access to the online workshop or the webinar? They need to register, right? So when they register, what is happening? I'm now migrating my messenger list to my email list. So remember in the previous slides, I was sharing with you the importance of uh, converting your messenger list to your email list because email, email marketing is still probably the number one uh, best strategy to reach your audience. So it is not a sneaky method because it is something that we present to them uh, upfront like, hey, you know, if you want to get on this online workshop, you have to register. And they accept that in that sense. So those are the, uh, the four types of so-called messages or promotion, quote-unquote promotion, that I will send to my messenger list. Okay, so um, there you have it. Uh, a training on, I'm sharing with you exactly how I will use the chatbot for my marketing campaign. It doesn't mean that it is to, to sell something, but it's for an overall marketing campaign, opening up like a new channel to get leads, followers, to build a brand, and of course, eventually, ultimately, to sell a product, right?